Hey guys, my name is Rybro, and welcome back to Life is Strange Before the Storm. Now, I just woke up. I woke up extra early today. I didn't even... So sorry if I look like, I don't know, a Chinese person or a raccoon with like thin black things around my eyes but i started binge watching life is strange the first season again and i found out some stuff that and it's it's really weird going back and like connecting like loops or looping connections uh and, and just seeing how everything ties in and like the the timelines and everything i like that's why i love like time travel so much it's not it doesn't really feel like life is strange that much because there's not like we don't have max i have been wondering this since i i started playing it if max has anything to do with it or if we'll even see her in the game because the one time in the first game when max and chloe were sitting in the diner chloe's mom was saying that she isn't even in school anymore and all of her hair is blue so like, Max should be around somewhere. I, d I don't really know. The big thing that I kind of missed was that Rachel Amber was missing in the first game. So, now I kind of have, like, a bigger insight of what I think is going to happen. Anyway, enjoy! <laughs> so. Junkyard Queen, where are you at? <laughs> hey. Holy shit. Your hair. It's so... <laughs> Badass. <laughs> I was gonna say hot. <laughs> but, yeah. Badass, too. <laughs> nice hey. feather earring. Not sure if you saw, but someone moved your truck. No way. <laughs> Should we check it out? Oh. <laughs> hey, Price. Nice wheels. Hi, Frank. You're early, Frank. What's the occasion? Christmas. It's his fucking bar mitzvah. Frank here's becoming a man. Aren't you, big guy? What's he doing here? What do you think? We're not dealing with a couple of dime bags anymore, Chloe. Where's the money? Uh. For fuck's sake, the money wasn't there. What do you want from me? I don't think she has it. Oh? It's cute how she acts like you two are friends. Get away from me. You heard what happened to Drew. Right? Maybe try keeping that in mind when you talk to me. I wasn't talking to you, I was talking to Frank. Don't... Fucking touch her. <laughs> uh, I take that back. <laughs> Why is it that chicks think it's okay to hit me? But if I lay a single finger on them, suddenly it's a whole other thing. Is you're an asshole? Frank says you were asking about a client of his. Is that true? Yes. Yeah, it's true. I don't see why you should give a shit. You don't? Maybe I'll show you. See, you two Nancy Drews decided it would be a good <laughs> idea to call your drug dealer and ask about his business. I didn't go to a fancy academy, but that doesn't strike me as smart. Maybe it was this man's sunny disposition that confused you, but he's got a whole other side to him that I don't think you'd like. He Should dyes his hair too? We're just talking here. 
Yeah, why'd you have to bring okay. him? Then let's talk. I want to know right now. Why you give a shit about this woman? Why do you care so much? Why do you care so much? Because fuck you. <laughs> I'm asking the questions here. Then okay. I'll answer your question None with of this that. Matters. All we care about is that you stop asking questions. Got it? No. Tell me where she is now, Rachel. Wait a minute. <laughs> no way. What the fuck is your Rachel? As in Rachel Amber? <laughs> that makes so much sense. This is James Amber's fucking kid. Damon, your dad's a real piece of shit. You know? Who cares? So? We don't have anything to do with him. Right. Here's what happens next. Come on, man. They're just kids. No, they're not. This one is the fucking DA's daughter. And right now, she's going to fill me in on what her daddy is up to. And how he's connected to that whore everyone's asking about. Damon, calm down. We're still talking. Everything's still cool. No need to get crazy. Oh. Oh. Get the knife. Oh, you fucking bitch. I'm not a dog. Come on, Frank, you can win. Frank. Is Frank okay? do anything. Rachel is going to be all right. The knife damaged her brachial artery, but didn't cut it. She's out of surgery, and surgery. now she's resting. Chloe, what happened? I'm trying to figure that out. I don't. I don't know. Everything did. happened so fast. Do you know who? Damon Merrick is? Or why he hates you? I know exactly who Damon Merrick is. Kick his ass. Start over. 
and tell me everything. Did you and Rachel try to contact Sarah? I'm not going to chastise or blame you, Chloe. Chastise. But I need the whole story. So, I got my dealer to meet us, since you know Sarah. Frank Bowers. Yeah, that's right. But Damon showed up with him. What did Merrick want? He asked us why we were so interested in Sarah. And what did you say? No, nothing of course. Is that how it became violent? When he found out Rachel was the DA's daughter, he, he wanted information about you. And how did he know that I'm her father? Maybe he's seen her before. What happened next? Damon had a knife out. We all could see it. Then he said something that pissed Rachel off. And she just grabbed a piece of wood and hit him. And then he stabbed her. I keep thinking that maybe I could have done something. But when he attacked her, I just froze. It's not your fault. And Frank held him off so we could get to the truck. I heard a scream. But I don't know what happened. And then we were here. I appreciate you telling me the truth. Um... What are you going to do about Damon? Find out if he is alive. First of all, my department's been after him for some time. I was told that if Rachel had arrived only a few minutes later, she might not have... Um... Thank you, Chloe. You saved my world. It will be some time before Rachel wakes up. I promise. I'll let you know when she does. Okay. Thanks. Hello. Hey. Steph, how's Drew? Pretty good. Miss Amber just told me Rachel's going to be okay. I'm really glad. Yeah. Well, our room's just down the hall. You should come by. Okay, sure. Definitely. I don't think I can sit still any longer. Out of order. Might as well. Just wakes, my makes my day worse. Wait for Rachel to wake up. Being in a hospital this long sucks. I just want Rachel to wake up, and then I'll feel better. I owe Frank big time. Can't believe he did that for us. I hope he's okay. I really do owe Frank. Hi, lady. No. Okay. You're like looking left for like if I an want hour. To stay sane. I need to stay busy. What's there to do around here? Anthony North. Can I high five him? He's on the phone. I, I, I don't think I should. Oh, okay. All right then. Thank you. Hi. Mr. North. That's me. Norma the North. And you are. I'm Chloe. Here to see Drew. Is that his yeah. dad? Yeah. <laughs> well, nice meeting you. 
How are, uh, how are things going? Oh, you know how it is. Ups and downs. Drew's hurt, of course. But there's other things going well for us. Uh, I'm moving back into my, my old apartment in two and a half hours. I don't know if you know this, but, uh... I know that. Mikey's been crashing <laughs> at Drew's dorm. I saw his comics oh. and stuff. Uh, I had a bit of trouble with work. Oh, wait. And it's all been pretty hard. Anyway. Hasn't his dad... He was on that, Drew like, homeless to poster, wasn't he? Scraped together enough to get me back on my feet. I'm glad things are starting to work out then. Hold on. You said you were Chloe. Mikey's mentioned you a few times now. <laughs> yeah, we no played games at the table. Answer. Sure. Both of those boys have been acting a little, well, guilty lately. Yeah, I, I've been spending most of my time looking for work. I'm worried I missed something important. Do you know if anything's going on with them? You should probably ask Drew. I uh, don't really know any details. I do know that whatever it is, they did it because they wanted to help you. Thanks, Chloe. They actually have helped me out. Money-wise. We're a family, you know? We deal with things together. We're oh, all happy me. family. Okay. It's firefighters. Just the fire went out. Went out? You mean it's controlled? No. It's completely out. It extinguished itself. How could that be? Extinguish. Hell Squandered. Hot, hello, hot firefighters. Appar <laughs> Do all girls think firefighters are sexy, I guess? I don't know. <laughs> Those guys look exhausted. Yeah. What can a hippo do to cheer me up? Stab. Eating the right foods keeps you healthy. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess. Then they'll just pour out and be like, but I wanted to eat that. Yeah, because the fire's coming right into the hospital. I'm a terrible person, by if the I way. Want to stay. Hello. I can't even express. Thank you so much. I'm sorry. I'm a wreck. We're both are. I stepped out to get some air. Rachel doesn't need me crying in front of her. You're here. I almost didn't notice it. Oh, yeah. It's... it's not a big deal. I bet Rachel was. I can't imagine what I would do if we lost her. Me too. You've grown so close, haven't you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's weird to think we just met a few days ago. We did? Just a few days? Meet someone who changes everything? You just know. Well, hang in there, Mrs. Amber. I will. When people hey. signed your cast. <laughs> made it. Oh. Hey, Chloe. Hey, Drew. <laughs> Fun day. How's your knee doing? Do they think it's gonna heal? Uh, I'm not sure, actually. It's too early to tell. Sorry to hear it. It's it's all good. <laughs> Love the hair, by the way. Pretty cool. <laughs> Barbarian colors. You should try it. <laughs> I bet you'd look cool with a little color. Yeah? I'll have to think about it. Maybe something red? Hey, any news about Rachel? Her mom seemed hopeful. Rachel's stable. She'll probably wake up soon. How'd she get hurt? You'll think I'm joking when I tell you, but I'm not. What happened? She got stabbed in the arm by demon fucking Merrick. Seriously? It, it wasn't because of me, was it? No. 
Should have been more careful. No, not at all. If anything, I should have thought about what happened to you before getting Rachel involved. That's crazy. Fuck that guy. I wish I could get my hands on him. Drew, chill out, okay? <coughs> oh, I'm headed out. Everything okay in here? Yep. Yeah. Don't have too much fun now. Try to keep it appropriate for the <laughs> Bye, Dad. See ya, Pops. No sex in the hospital, please. We should have a tabletop game. Maybe I shouldn't have mentioned Damon. Rachel's gonna be up soon. Should probably head over when I'm ready. <laughs> a pudding fat. <laughs> oh, I want to eat that right now. Well, right now, we oh, in the pudding. <laughs> you can't just take it from <laughs> all flowers. Those must be from Steph's parents. Oh. Hey Drew, sorry to hear about your leg. We're really gonna miss your talent and leadership on the field of for the duration of your recovery. Rest up, let me know if you need anything. Coach McKenna. Are they they're playing the little game they have it set up? Okay. Goodbye. Right. It was nice seeing seeing you guys. I'm gonna head out. It was really great to see you, Chloe. Agreed. Don't be a stranger, okay? <laughs> Yeah. He so reminds me of John. Tell Rachel we're rooting for her. You bet. Chloe, this is Mr. Amber. Rachel is still is wa just waking up now. I'm sure she'd love to see you. Thanks. Ooh. Oh, I'm gonna see her. Well, it's just her arm. Just her arm. That. <laughs> nice pajamas. I'm glad that you're here. Me too, Rachel. It really hurts. Shh. The pain will pass. I'll help the pain pass. Chloe's here. By not making you think about it. You want me to stay? No. I'll be okay. Thanks, Dad. I'll come back. In a little while. Get that vending machine working. <laughs> My guardian angel. Steph says, hey, <laughs> I want to say both. <laughs> I saw Steph earlier. She says, hey. Steph's so cute, but not as cute as you. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I mean it. Beep. 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 Rachel. I'm sorry. What? What for? Not doing anything. You're here because of me. Because I choked back there in the junkyard. What? Shut up. You were so fierce and I, I just froze. God, I fucked it up. I'm so sorry. And, and you saved my life. You saved my life. I almost lost you. I can't believe I almost... You're not getting rid of me that easy. Good. Happy that your dad's here. I mean... I'm still mad at him. For everything he's done. But... It felt so good to lean on him. He's my dad, you know? I felt completely safe. Like, on Mount Hood. <laughs> oh. 
Would you do something for me? Anything. Sarah. Mom. <laughs> it's so weird to say. I'm not even sure what she is, honestly. But... <laughs> I think I still want to meet her. Yeah. I figured you would. I don't even know if she's still in Arcadia Bay. But if she is, will you find her? Please. You really want this. Don't you? I do. Chloe. I really do. I'll find her. Then, of course. Whatever it takes. I'll be a pirate. I bet my pirate. dad has her number. Treasure. Maybe in Hunt. his office. <laughs> Our house keys just under the mat. The code is 0722. To your... Your dad's office? 0722. Yeah. My birthday. I'll find her, Rachel. July 22nd? And then I'll... I'll tell her how fucking cool you are. <laughs> Thank you, Chloe. Punch. Oh, that actually hurt. Sorry. Right. Everything. Don't you fall asleep now? Well, maybe. Because you need it. to scare me no <laughs> um, <laughs> hey <laughs> what is that hey. in your head? <laughs> wait your hair it's different Yeah. Yeah. I like it. It's, uh, it's nice. Sorry about the Tempest. Nice balloon. How you been? Um, nice balloon. Uh, nice balloon. I guess. <laughs> yeah, it's for Drew. Were you, were you just in there? I'm actually here for Rachel. What? Rachel's here? What happened? Um I should I should tell him. Uh she got stabbed by a psycho. Oh my god. Yeah. It was insane. Holy shit. Are, are you okay? trying to be I wasn't stabbed um <laughs> don't wave that balloon in my face I mean I'm probably not okay but I can deal with that later are you, are you two in some kind of trouble you can tell me if you are you know I won't judge um, nothing we can't handle. I'll keep you posted. Um, what do you mean? I'll keep you posted. I'll make sure to keep you posted. Right now, I'm here to take care of Rachel. Chloe! I'm seriously worried about you. Well, don't be. Uh, I mean... 
You're hanging out with Rachel Amber a lot lately. Right? So what? So... Obviously, something is going on. It's okay. I swear, man. Everything's really okay. Okay. I trust you. Just remember I'm here, okay? If you suddenly need something. Thanks. Anyway, I can't take you seriously with you holding that. See you around. Yeah. See you around, Chloe. I feel bad for him. We never tell him anything, but he's so... He, he like, wants to be a part of everything. Stop looking at sad people. It'll make you more sad. Need to write it down. <laughs> I need to search this office for any communication with Sarah that can help me find her. Lock drawer. Just, 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 just. Able to smash my way through this one. I'm going to uh, leave this episode here. It's been, it's been recording a long time. Um, I like this episode so far. I'm trying to make everything better. Our family is getting along. I got the truck moving. Um, but I, uh, what's going to happen now? Like, how long is Rachel going to be in the hospital before we get to, like, like do stuff? And I really want to get into, like, like Frank and, and all of his friends. I want to kill him! Or, no? Okay. <laughs> that, that happened, like, <laughs> like, half an hour ago. His calm room. But, uh, I, I still love this game. Uh, sometimes there's, like, gaps where I'm not saying anything because sometimes I, I just want to let the game play by itself. Um, that, that might be boring for some people, but I, I still enjoy it. I, I like showing the whole game. So, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Share with a friend. And I hope to see you in the next one. So, bye for now. See you soon. I don't know. Don't be me and leave your baby at 2 a.m. in the morning. Don't do it. Don't. Ah, I'm scared.